most of it's probably mental. You don't like dark places that are wet and uh, you're claustrophobic. You have a bunch of phobias and stuff, but it's not going to be the place for you. Okay, good morning everyone. So we're at Castle Dome and here with Gabe Romo and uh, we've got a really exciting project here. So uh, the owner of this uh, of this mine here, um, Alan, who owns, uh, there's a museum called Castle Dome, he invited us here to explore this. Now this is the oldest patented mine in Arizona. It's got hundreds of feet of workings. No one's been in it since the 1870s, some of it. Yesterday we was down this shaft here, it goes down 220 feet, and we found um, six pair of Levi's dating back to the 1800s, from 1870 and 1890. There's only five known pair in the world, two of the Levi's own. Alan owns another pair and there's two other ones. Um, there was one pair that was sold for reported $50,000. So theoretically we, uh, we found $300,000 worth of uh, with Levi's. And uh, the deal I made with him is we'll explore it and anything we find we'll give to you. So we uh, give them to Alan and he's going to have them on display uh, on his museum. So if you look at Castle Dome's uh, Castle Dome Museum or CastleDome.com or something, you can see where this is. Um, we're right between uh, Yuma and uh, Quartzsite, so so we're gonna go down there, and where we found these jeans, um, they were partially covered in a, in, a, in a big pile of rocks. So we're taking this down, and we're going to excavation. We're gonna take all that rock out there and see if we can find any more real core artifacts yeah. back from the 1800s. So we'll go down there and see what we can find. Pulled it up. The bag actually broke. So somewhere down there, there's some really expensive pants that fell down. So my GoPro was in this bag that probably maybe fell up to 200 feet, but um. It's not the most valuable cargo, the jeans. You know, <laughs> yeah. when we go to mines, people always talk about, you know, you find gold and silver and all this kind of stuff. Those jeans are worth more than their weight in gold. So uh, I guess we struck gold. <laughs> <laughs> yep, all right, let's go get them. We went down. <laughs> Pretty much just straight down. smokes every single time this is a really narrow one I just realized I have sunglasses on why it was so dark. It's gonna take all day to get up. Alright. Going down is the easy part. <clears throat> Can't stop now, that's for sure. All right, here we go. Here we go. Wow. I hope I get down there soon. This is way deeper than I thought. Thank <laughs> you. 
well. Oh, oh. I was supposed to film you coming up. That was the whole point of me doing oh. it. There we go. So I found an old miner's boot. <laughs> an old sock. Nothing in it. Cool. Some clothes. What is that? That might be a pair of jeans. That could be pretty valuable. So we found some artifacts. Super, super old, old pair of jeans. Those are, those are jeans too? Yeah. And those are? Just pull them up. I'm gonna move the, move the dirt out of the way here. Too much of a rush. Nope. Just take that. Oh, so seven pairs of jeans somewhere. We're not gonna. We're gonna excavate everything on this side of the rock, right down to the to the ground, I think. And then uh, some point, either us or somebody else can uh, can go back from here. One back pocket. Oh, I see. Yeah, only one back pocket. Okay, that makes them before 1900. Huh. And we found, I don't know, four or five pair all in one location that we had to dig them up. I had to excavate. And we saw one or two pair on the surface, and we just kept digging and digging, and we made them all the way through. They got, the, they got the donut buttons. Yep. Uh, they got the little. You know, there's only uh, there's five pairs in this vintage. There's more now. There's more now. <laughs> really? Yeah, it's way dusty now. Oh, we got here. Oh well. Kind of tin. See? You see that? There's some uh, kind of rose colored quartz. The bone box any found bones? I like the bad. It's a good thing. Women back then didn't work in the mine. And we'd be digging out a really long dress. Man, how much more jeans could there be? Let's see. Is there more than one pair? Yeah, there is. Oh, that's cool. In the back, they're sewed up a little bit, like makeshift. Mm -hmm. No miners didn't have it. That'd have been nice. If he left his wallet in there. Pretty rough shape. Hopefully, maybe they'll just make them to payday. Yeah. Pretty small pair of jeans, though. Man, Alan's gonna be static over this because there's a pair of these Levi's that are sold for about fifty thousand dollars. Really. Mm -hmm. there's, no, there's a whole bunch of jeans. There's, it's like there's a whole Chinese laundry in there. <laughs> wow, fifty thousand dollar pair of jeans. Two hundred, two fifty. <laughs> <laughs> Little did the miner know, and he took that pair off that they're worth more than the new pair he wanted. Uh, that goes deeper, doesn't it? No? Hope not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, yeah, in the pockets. Oh, there'd be so many jeans in here. It's weird, eh? Videotaping this. She's rolling. We, we have been. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah. <clears throat> well, think there's any more? That's like five pair. Four pair. <laughs> we got. We're gonna have a hard time getting up. I don't think I was gonna care about the few pieces of zinc that we took. <laughs> <laughs> we're working, man. Oh no, we were gonna. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> This is where a pair of jeans in there. There's a so pair of jeans in there? Yeah, I put a pair, one pair in there. I just, well, there's only going to be two pair. Okay. Uh, now I got room for the camera. So obviously he hasn't scored this one. Yeah, yeah. No, he would have taken that. Okay. But this uh, pair has only got one leg. So this is the seventh. Pair of jeans we found so far. All right. All right. So here's all the charges that we found in here. So all this material was this high, and we cut, we excavated all this out of here and put it down there. What we found is there's a lot of burnt material in here. So I almost thinking maybe this is kind of a little dump underground. They just threw a bunch of stuff in here and they tried to burn it, and some of it burnt, some of it didn't. So we got a total of seven pairs of jeans all together. Um, this one here has one leg off it, so it's not as good a shape, but again, all from the 1800s. And we'll explain all this when we get it top side, instead of having all this dust going everywhere. And uh, so here's, there's a bunch of nails. These are old square nails. They made handmade back in the 1800s. Blacksmith would have made them. This is a canteen. I don't know what it was, but Gabe said it was a canteen. Makes sense. The two straps there. To the little canteen. There's lots of socks that we found here. Uh, I guess you gave up on this one. It's just a sack full of nails, and this is newer. So it's kind of funny. It has newer nails in it. Very new, so. Maybe they fell, maybe they just fell down from the top when they were doing some work up top. I don't know. And this is the coolest artifact we found. The perfect shape. I know it's not very many people to have these. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah, that's a little newer. Um, yeah, so that's about it. So we found. We're not going to dig anymore. It's, the dust is just cleared up out here, but it's just, just brutal on your lungs. And we got seven pairs of jeans, and we'll leave the rest for maybe a future explorer that wants to excavate this. <laughs> All right. Just found a pair of jeans, a couple of them. Now we're going to try and we're gonna stick all this stuff in. pack them up, and we have a long way up oh, to climb. Boot? Oh, yeah, boot too. Mm -hmm. All I'm going to do is. How are we going to put all this stuff in there? It is so oh. dusty. I know. Just go slow. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna try to stick the jeans in there. Alright, I'll I'm gonna have to do so probably gonna have to go up. I can't stick my camera in there while I'm jeans. Um I could have tied the rope on the bottom. Good time to just rope to that rope and then just pulled it up later. You think so? So we're just gonna leave these old burnt sacks in this here. Well, maybe somebody else wants to come and see if they can find some more. And uh, again, we just found them all in this area, but we just threw all the rock, a lot of the rock and stuff up in there, so it's possible there could be some under there yet. Um, but I don't know, but you know, it's a lot of loose stuff. It's really, there's a lot of material in here. Who knows what could be under there, but. It's really dusty and it's a lot of work to move it. And uh, a couple things we didn't show you. A couple of lizards here guarding the <laughs> a gecko. One there. And there's another one here somewhere. <laughs> a couple of them here that were... Who knows how old them guys are? <laughs> They're going to guard this stash of old miner stuff. It's going to take a while. We got our bag back up here. And 
We had a couple of people helping us pull it up, so this is where the shaft goes down. It is about 2.30, there you go. Oh my gosh. Hold one of those, Alan. Uh, let me see, I'm looking for the... He's a world expert on Levi's jeans. <laughs> see, those ones, they had a big hole and someone patched them, see that? Isn't that cool? Oh, these are... Uh, before 1880. Got, it's got a little button on the crotch kind of, eh? Well, it's got a... It's reinforced there. Oh, that's unusual. That's yeah. I've never seen that. Yeah. That's, uh... You know, the mine was worked in extensively in the late 1860s. Look how small they are. They're just like for kids, eh? Yesterday's was the oldest in the world, and this is maybe in the same vintage. So oh, there's yeah. two yeah. that are before 1880. Well, every one of these is Levi Strauss so far. Well, these are... Uh, any rips in the back? Yeah, they yeah. always got one rip. rip on the left side. Now these are, uh, these were, uh, and those have that sewing right there. No, no, these are a little newer. These are about 1890, and they had the patch. Patch. And, yeah. But they're exceptional. Look at that, he had them tied up. Yeah. They didn't have no belt, so. So now there's five pairs <laughs> in the world of this vintage. This is in really good condition. So that's, now that's six. Seven. And then the other pair was from peg leg. They only had one leg. So that's five, six, seven. You know the story of the crotch rivet? They have the, the wax on them too. You they got see the wax, wax on them. You know what happened with that? One of the executives went to a campfire and got burned and that was the end of the crotch rivet. <laughs> 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 Yeah, it was just a couple of socks we brought up. I don't know if you really yeah, wanted them. I think them, that was it for the jeans. Okay, what's... Okay, so this, see? The tag's in the middle, see it? Oh, good. Okay, so that's... This, uh... Classifies as the oldest pair ever. Man, they make pretty tough jeans, eh? 150 years? <laughs> we found uh, some work shoes. Oh, oh, a couple of shoes, yeah. Ooh. That was wow. the other one to the one you got yesterday. These have to go in the little thing Stephanie wants to do. Really? But look at this that boot. See, look, it's, it's corked, eh? See, look at it. It's got corks on it. I know. That's like, eight, that's 1870s. Yeah. This and is. And that's it. Pretty great. I mean, unbelievable. And we got this tin. Is that tobacco can? Yeah. Yeah, they're really common. You see them everywhere. Yeah. Before the turn of the century, no belt loops. They had suspenders. Oh, okay. And they have one back pocket. Belt loops were invented in 1901. Yeah, no, they didn't no. have them before that. And they have the stitching here, see it? Uh -huh. Okay, so these are... There's... about four pair of these that have been discovered in the world. Levi Strauss bought a pair of these for 35000 1878. And they're... Uh, the way they're 18... See, the tag has moved to the middle. Right. Still no belt loops, so that's before 1880. Now, the ones that Levi Strauss have, have uh, some V-stitching here, and these don't have it, so they added the V-stitching, is what mm -hmm. I believe. Now, what happened with Levi Strauss's 1906 earthquake fire, right. so a lot of the records are gone, and the best record is uh, the, one of the best records is right here, uh -huh. Uh -huh. finding all these pants. Well, so, now, so this would be for adjusting the size to your No, belt? that adjusts the, yeah, cinches your waist since you don't mm -hmm. have belt loops, and right. then you're holding it up with suspenders. Right. And it's only got okay. one back pocket. Yeah. That's funny, we didn't find any other clothes other than a sock. But in there, there's no shirts or suspenders. So I was going to say, do you ever, have you ever found shirts? Or I have. I found a, jo a jean jacket one time with one arm. Now see, these are uh, 1880 to 1890. That is very nice. Oh, weave. Yeah. What's that? Another jean. Another jean? Huh? Yeah. Lost track, I guess. I thought we only had three pair that we brought up. Oh no, there's. Oh, that's right. There was four. These are. Uh, there should be another pair. No. Maybe in the bag here. Maybe. Yeah, that's because another pair. Okay, yeah. look, these are the uh, number three before 1880. Yeah. 
<laughs> well, now look. No stitching no here. No stitching, yep. So this these three pair are the oldest Levi's in existence. The, this those three plus the one we found. How, how many do we have with the in the back? Yeah, so you that's got a, five. That's, a, that's 1890. You got five pair here, and we got two back at your house, so we got seven pair in two days. And that's more than have been found ever. Yeah. Wow. That is Amazing. incredible. Really but there's a lot of mines I haven't been to yet, so. Yeah, but they got to be old. <laughs> <laughs> this is the uh, oldest mine in Arizona? Yeah, the longest worked. Well, longest worked. Seven. Well, there's Spanish ones that are older, they go well, 500 Spanish years. But then you're not going to find anything. No, you're not going to find. You're not going to find no jeans and any spice points. That's for sure. Now the. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, yeah, we go. That's where we got all them jeans. Wait a minute. 